Hey guys. We just killed that fucking dragon. <clears throat> Let's go report back to our quote unquote business partner. Pretty sure he's. No, he's in High Town, that's right. Dude, hmm. Have I been totally avoiding the gallows for a very long time? Like, have I gone to the gallows for much of anything? I think I've totally just left this completely off my, uh, my radar. Having a little panic attack right now. No! Herbalist task? What the hell's going on? Yeah. I don't really come here much, do I? You've been in Parkwall as long as I have. Does it feel Rune of Protection, no thanks. There you go. Let's sell a bunch of garbage here. <clears throat> Here's a belt. Let's just sell all of it besides that. We'll just keep on selling. Keep those. Boots. Keep that. That's got a nice name, so we'll keep it. We'll keep it. Keep it. I could totally sell that if I wanted to. And... We're just going to sell it. Sell it. Sell it. Sell it. Sell it. Sell it. Keep it. Hmm. Sell it, sell it. Sell it, keep it. Nope, we're gonna sell it. 39 dexterity. I don't have 39 dexterity, what? We're gonna sell it. Sell it, sell it. Sell it. The offhand blade. I should probably equip that, but I do not have enough dexterity for time. Sell it. Sell it. Sell it. Sell it. And sell it. <coughs> I'll be right back. I gotta go check something. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. It sounded like someone was in my apartment, so I had to go check. All good. Let's check the weapon shop. Would you look at that? Maybe that's enough. Hmm. I sure hope I didn't miss a lot. What's up, Fenrir? The mages should not fight the Lord. Hey yo, mage goods. Hmm. Nope. Out of here. We were lucky. What's up, Solovitius? Eh. So good to see you, champion. Thanks, bro. Welcome back, my friend. My store has never been better stocked thanks to you. 
although I have nothing else to ask you to find, you're quite welcome to bring back any rare specimens you may come across. I'd be more than happy to craft something just for you. It's the least I can do for the champion of Kirkwall. I took this fire gland from a high dragon just outside the city. You killed a high dragon? Incredible. Let me see the fire gland. Is there anything you can make from it? This fire gland is a remarkable specimen. Wait here. I know exactly what I can craft from this. This turned out beautifully. Something worthy of our champion. I hope you can put it to good use. Where's the user's tooth? What is that? Noise. Use her as tooth. There we are. Plus one to all attributes. 20 health. Damn. Thank you. Whoa. That's good shit. So does that mean I can use... Yes it does. Look at that. Look at that. That's nice. That is nice. Nice, nice, nice. Alright. Pretty pumped about that. Templar Hall. What's Templar Hall? <clears throat> Andalus. Um, I think there's an achievement for this, so we'll do that. And Mine Massacre. That's right, you have to talk to him. Famed Elven Assassin from Antiva. Yep. Go to Darktown to confront the person asking after Gamlin. Great. Huh. Then we still have Mark of the Assassin. Remember the incident at the Chateau Hein? Chateau Hein. Was that the place where, um,. Where that guy was getting blown by that elf, and he's all like, Oh! Oh my! I might have to do a little research on that. We're gonna go to... Let's go to High Town, right? Or is it at night? It's at night. The faith, the faith, the faith. I'm really getting back into this game. I think that little vacation I had was um, just the remedy for uh, being a little fatigued with this game. Now I kind of just want to keep on playing it. Right, here you go, Hubert. A dragon attacked your mine. Everyone is dead. Dear Maker, what of my equipment? Did it seem salvageable? Unfortunately, your precious equipment didn't make it. And neither did your workers. Oh, my heart. So many years of investment. I am ruined. 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 I'm sorry, champion. I appreciate your help, but I sank all my coin into that rotten mine. I have nothing left to pay you. Give me the bone pit. Perhaps in a few years I can get it back in order. What? Ha! Huh. Fine. Take it. I wash my hands of this cursed venture. Nice. I understand you're named after a famous knight. Everyone always brings up the name. I've not I'm pumped. Even though I'll never ever see any sort of return on that mine, it's still nice to know I have a little extra property. Not to slaves. Have you located any Canari blades? This is what I found. If you find more, bring them to me. How many more are there? Christ.
Okay. <clears throat> let's um let's see what's going on in the red rose. The blooming rose. finished my drink and we're only 10 minutes into the video well if it's a half hour video I can manage we'll just see where this where this uh this episode takes us it's the only real knock nah never mind. it's not the only real knock I have with this game but one of one of my knocks on this game is how freaking long the loading takes Alright, I'm gonna go through this for glowies. Uh huh. Pay dirt. Not a lot of pay dirt, but eh. Take what you can. Corv, what's brought your sorry ass up to this part of town? I can't drink it, the hanged man. It's like kissing me sister. What? I was thinking of changing my hairstyle. That's brilliant. You've had this one for seven years now. Huh. You won't find better prices. All right. That's not a weird thing to say to someone as soon as they come into a door. You won't find better prices, I tell you. You won't. Believe me, I've looked. It's a nice fireplace. What's up? Right, drinks. Coming. Sit. I haven't seen the Seneschal much lately. Don't tell me my hat's gone. Well, well. The champion visits the blooming rose. What an occasion. My people offer three types of service. For two sovereigns, you get the royal treatment. One sovereign gets you the standard services. For 50 silver, someone pretends to like you for an hour. Um... Sure, give me the best. Here's two sovereigns. I want the best you've got. Certainly, Messer. Our companions are in the lounge. Choose whomever you like. Interesting. He just keeps terrible hours now. I'm just here for the medicinal benefits. Serendipity. What a name. Serendipity. Catriella. Adriano. Um, Catriella. Serendipity's got like some dark elf going on thing. Eh, they're all elves. Um, I'd rather have this one. Well, it's good, Serendipity. Well, aren't you adventurous? Whoa! Let's get you some experience, sweetie. Ah! That was all that was? Wow. Well, now we know, right? You're all so fancy. You can take this out. God damn it, my cats are just going at each other. So annoying. There's a war coming. Does it feel different fighting by choice? Alright, we're out of here.
not a whole lot of interesting stuff going on in the Blooming Rose. I wasn't expecting Serendipity's voice to sound like that. I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. The problem with my cats is that it's always the young one beating up on the old one. I feel bad for the old one, and the old one's always screaming like, the older one, or the younger one, doesn't say a goddamn thing. It's like, oh god. It's too fate to fate to fate. Well, I guess it would be nice if I could touch your body. If I know not everybody has got a body like you. But I better think twice before I give my heart away. <sighs> before this river. Alright, I should stop singing now. Even though it sounds so good, right? What's up, bro? Evening, Captain. Oh, Blood Dragger. Oh my god. One less to worry about. That was simple enough. Okay, on to the next. You know what I have a problem with? Or what I have a problem with, rather? Is people who, um... Like, let's say they have a noisy dog. Like a dog who's always barking. And, uh, they'll just... They'll just, you know, totally ignore it, even if it's inconveniencing everyone else around them. Because they're just so used to it, or they're just trying to ignore it. Like, they're so used to ignoring it that they don't even really hear it anymore. People like that really piss me off. And I try not to be that person. I don't think people can hear my cat through the wall. But whenever they do that, whenever they start making all sorts of racket, I just get really mad and I yell at them. I them to stop yelling, or stop freaking out, you know? Because I think... You know, if I was a neighbor and all I heard was a bunch of cats arguing all the time, or fighting, that I would be super annoyed and that I'd want those cats to shut up. So, I don't know. I feel like a bit of a dick when I just let them go on like that. Nah, I mean... Oh. Alright. There's nothing up here. We'll just look. There's something. Bronze Andrast Holy Symbol. Dude, you didn't see us fighting down there? A lazy bum. Boo, 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 boo. Hey everyone.
We're just running around town. Running around town. The Shetsu Hine. I'm gonna have to look up what that was because ah, I don't know. The guide said not to do it till Act Three, or in Act Three. Didn't specifically say that I shouldn't do it right away in Act Three. So, do I just wait? Do I play a little bit more of Act Three and then I'll I'll definitely know when the Shetsu Hine incident happened. Or should I just go into it assuming that they're going to fill me in on what actually happened? So I'd like to do it. Have all the DLC out of the way before I get to the end game. Get out of my way! Oh god, no, no, no. Shit. I missed. Oh god, he blew up. Oh my god, 10 gold. That's awesome. Alright, face to face to face da. Once again, you're not doing your job. We were just fighting down there. All, oh, all quiet around here, huh? Good carry on. What are you, crazy? We were just in a fight, you... Ah, uh, this city's corrupt. The city guard is in the pockets of the blood thralls, or whatever the hell those things are called. Blood drags. Something like that. I see it in my memory shot. <sighs> I drink... Oh, never mind. Hold that thought. I think. Oh, yeah. Good call. Thank you. What up, Fenris? What up, Dow? Level up. I drink Nas energy drink because Nas energy drink is the only energy drink that actually tastes pretty good. And, um,. I drink it, and then I'm immediately tired. I, there's something very wrong. Well, you're an archer, right? I think you're an archer. Yeah, you're a royal archer. Inventory. Inventory. Here you go. Do that. Do that. You can wear this. And then... Yeah, you could do that. There you go. There you go, buddy. Okay. Faith to faith. Is 
surprise. Nothing up here. The Vicar's sealed off since his death. A strange place for a holy sister to be. Yeah, turn around. Done. Oh, this isn't spooky. So, even the divine fears us now. She should kill the spies. Spies. Oh god. Cool sideburns, bro. Who are you? The resolutionists. I might have known they would be part of this. You look cool. Who are you? Are you Sister Nightingale? I am. Oh, and shit! You call me Liliana. Shit! The Divine sent me to investigate the possibility of a rebellion here in Kirkwall. I have some experience in unconventional situations. The Leliana? Who accompanied the hero of Ferelden to slay the Archdemon? Ah. I see it will be harder to remain anonymous so near the Ferelden border. Yes. I knew the hero of Ferelden. Perhaps you have heard the songs I wrote of our time together. But that was many years ago. I am working for the Divine now. In Orlais. I had not thought to return to this part of Thedas. I remember her. I thought she was like a nerdy bookworm, not some badass. Damn. Who are the resolutionists? An offshoot of a fraternity within the circle of Magi. Supported by the Magisters. There's no proof of that. I bet a lot of mages think they'd enjoy Tevinter's freedoms. And completely forget that few ever achieve the power to enjoy them. There have always been factions that support freedom from the Chantry and the abolition of the Circle. We have tolerated them, but the Resolutionists have become violent. They are likely behind the unrest here. I appreciate you stepping in back there. Of course. They mistook you for me. So they must know I am in Kirkwall. The Divine has long suspected that Kirkwall's problems were spurred by an outside group. Like any mage with a brain can't come up with, let's rebel. As if any mage with a brain couldn't conceive of anything else. This attack proves she is right. Are you saying you set this whole thing up? I let word slip that an agent of the Divine was coming to investigate the mage troubles. It is how they chose to react which condemns them. Will the Divine send soldiers? Divine Justinia takes the situation here very seriously. She believes it is the worst threat to Thedas since the Cunara invaded. A handful of apostates? How can that possibly... <laughs> the whole world is watching Kirkwall. If it falls to magic, none of us are safe. None of you? Tell Elthina to leave. There is refuge for her at the Grand Cathedral in Orlais. She will not be safe here.
These mages are out of control. Huh. That was cool. Catch up on one of the one of my um old buddies. These mages are out of control. Check our journal. See, they should just have more DLC like this where it just spans the entire game. I'm sure this is like a pre-ordered DLC or something, so it seems to be like, you know, woven into the story pretty well. Like they just sort of planned to have this be in the game. They took it out and it's like, oh, if you pre-order it, you can uh, play this part of the game too. It's, uh, they, that, um, Mass Effect 3. What the hell was the name of that DLC? Where you go back to Eden Prime. And you get to see the Prometheans. I forget. But it, it's like a very vital part of the game. Like that, that companion is pretty, pretty important. And they're just like, eh. Let's just take it out and sell it as DLC. It's like, eh, Bioware, I don't think you should be doing that. What is it, daytime now? Injustice the Templars are. Must I? I see Templars trying to control what they have good reason to fear. They go too far. So, where are we going here? Take me to the chantry, hi, baby. I saw you at the chantry last week, Fenris, but I haven't seen you back since. I was only delivering something. You needn't concern yourself. But you were praying. Or was that part of the delivery? I was trying to blend in. Oh, yes. You wouldn't want to ruin your reputation. Don't you have a city to reconquer? Sister Nightingale says you must leave Kirkwall. What? You were right. The Divine will be taking action against Kirkwall, though the Sister didn't say what. You must take the holy relics from the Chantry and leave for safety. Sebastian, I'm surprised at you. Andraste would not thank me for saving a few dusty finger bones and my own skin at the cost of people's lives. You do no one any good if you're dead. When I became Grand Cleric, I took a vow to the people of Kirkwall and the Free Marches. I will not leave my flock. Would you let yourself die? There is no greater devotion than to lay one's life at the Maker's feet. There is no better death than to take the blow for another. Sister Nightingale took a great risk to warn you. Don't be rash. Please, Your Grace. Sister Nightingale thinks there will be war. Then, I must make peace. Settle yourself, Sebastian. I'm in no personal danger. I am Grand Cleric. Who would dare attack me? Famous last words. If you will not shield yourself, then I will be your shield. You will come through this safely by the Maker's name. I swear it. There we go. There we go. 25 points. Met secretly with the Agent of the Divine. Hey. 25 points, bringing my grand total up to 83,405 points. Hey -o. So, I'm still not friends with him, huh?
Whatevs. That's it. That's part 42 for you. Creeping up on that 40 hour mark. I believe... Nah, I'm gonna guarantee that this will be our first 50 part series. At least 50 parts. There's gonna be games in the future that'll probably top 100 parts, like... I wanna get into the Final Fantasies, I wanna get into some of my JRPGs like uh, Star Ocean, The Last Hope, and um, I got a buttload of Tales games I've never played, and Resonance of Fate, and all sorts of other JRPGs I want to get into. But right now I'm just taking it slow, hitting some of those points, hitting, some, hitting a few of those games that I feel I missed that I uh, that I should have played when they first came out. So it'll be a long time before I get to those games, but goddamn it, we're gonna get to them. Alright, thanks for watching. See you next time.